It is halfway through day four of seven of building a game mm -hmm. up here in the water tower using cursor. Yep. TJ just one shot in every feature you're seeing on the screen right here, yep. including the acid trip that is the uh, islands. But before we kind of get show you a little bit of the gameplay, we're going to talk a little bit about some of the cool things we've done. Uh, the biggest thing that I think we both did mm -hmm. is that we cleaned up a lot of vibe coding today, yeah. particularly just routing of data. Yeah. Bullets. Where our enemies were getting damaged before the bullets were even drawn on the map. Experience was drawn in the weirdest way. Things were just like, just going every last which direction. So we're just kind of working it out, taking them out, separating them out. And now it's less crazy. At one point, towers updated their own projectiles flying through the air. That's just kind of weird. Yeah. Enemies were removing themselves in this weird way and then doing a notification. Mm -hmm. And the notification never actually got like, rendered or anything we just rendered these gold notifications that are supposed to be coins that just never happened it was just like insanity everywhere uh, ed was opening magic packs all day today it was oh, rather crazy love me some magic all right yeah but big features big features tar tower tar tower so we had this idea of you know normally in a tower defense you have a tower that shoots a thing at an enemy projectiles do damage etc how do we apply effects to enemies we made a system where the cells on the grid have modifiers and the enemies check to see if that modifier should apply to them so what we have is this thing called a tar tower now where the tar tower will apply to the cells around it a speed modifier enemies look into that speed modifier and say oh I need to slow down and that's kind of how we get a lot of the big TD stuff going obviously the one in six chance you don't see a tower card or a tower card happens here and uh, boom so we don't have a sprite for it yet but you see here we have a tower that will slow them down lays down tar look and now boom look how slow it's going down it's freaking and then awesome. it goes Boom, go faster. Future features in the tower world are poisons, right? So we want to have a poison modifier applied to the ground so it dots it damage over times on enemies. Not there yet, but we're pretty confident we know the system on how to do that. So that's future work for tomorrow. And also, you can also imagine like frost like bolts that mm -hmm. will land on the ground and then freeze the ground for yeah. a small period of time. Yeah. Also going to be pretty awesome, a lot, right? A lot of work today was significantly un unwounding the projectile logic. Now projectiles exist as kind of their own objects, so a projectile can carry modifiers like freezing. So when it explodes, it applies modifiers to the ground and we go from there. Uh, also one fun bug. Uh, we had enemies not spawning every now and then, then the wave would just complete and we mm -hmm. couldn't figure out what was happening. Mm -hmm. It turns out that unordered maps got us. We had an empty path that was existing. The enemies would immediately just all disappear and then the game would complete, but it only happened like half the time. Yeah. It just it turns out random. JSON and unordered maps. Yeah, I had two paths. One had zero uh, points to it. And so the game would, because of unordered maps, randomly choose that zero node path and just we would win the game. We couldn't figure it out. But Prime, with his Lua knowledge, knocked it out of the park. But good news is we got some more art in mm -hmm. from Adam. Yep. Looking really good. And look at this. I don't know if you guys know this, it's still balloons. And it says we completed the wave. Okay. I know. Well, we're That's working on that We're one. working on that. And we even have tower upgrades now, vampire uh, survivor style. So we can go range plus one, a little bit bigger. You see that? That yeah. range just you, got bigger. You will also notice we had a significant overhaul to basically the entire graphic system today. So originally, probably in the previous videos, you saw that we had like an inner rendering canvas and an outer rendering canvas. We said, screw that, too complicated. Got rid of it all. So it's now gone. we have the wonderful textures from Adam that are going to display on the entire screen and we have this idea of a non-placeable area all that means is when you click on a card you just can't put it where there are ui elements but the graphics will cover the entire yeah. screen much more i think visually pleasing and makes it kind of a whole like you know immersive experience all right that's it man now it's up for tj good work with us today we've got adam Eunice. Uh, the bet that I made with Trash that we would have amazing art completed by a human in this water tower has officially begun and I knew that I would win because I knew Adam was going to be here all the way from Australia. So take that Trash Dev, uh, that sucks to suck, I guess. Uh, and you can't say anything because you're not here right now, but maybe you will be later. So Adam's here, he's working on our art and he's helping us a bunch. Thought we'd give a quick update, sort of uh, the journey, how we got here from Ed's uh, terrible sprites that we started with and how we got to this uh, beautiful, amazing art and the progression we're going. So Adam, why don't you take it away a little? No worries. Hey everyone, I'm Adam. I am a game developer and content creator. I stream here on Twitch and everywhere else. Me too. And, uh, <laughs> 
Uh, today, you know, I'm just helping out the boys this week, trying to make a sick uh, tower defense game. So I started, look, not really knowing what the guys were cooking. So <laughs> I either. started with, uh, I started with something really simple, just colors, palettes, trying to figure out, okay, what's the vibe for this world? How big should cards be as we move forward? You know, I just started mucking around some enemy designs, thinking about, yeah, how big these should be, what colors we can work with, looking at UI, all kinds of stuff like that. Uh, we've got some character portraits. We're finding a style here. Uh, what else we got here? We got some tile sets. Orbs. We have orbs. orbs. Chaos orbs have been, you know, something that's been working its way into the stream. We're, yeah. we're, we're vibing uh, as we code. And so we've got chaos orbs kind of working their way into the game as items. You collect these, uh, they modify the way that you play the game. And I've just been creating a bunch of different variations on those. Current uh, little showcase here, you can see we got some uh, really cool items, all these orbs. And uh, yeah, this is kind of where we're at now. Actually, we also did a little bit of uh, today, a little bit of working on some orcs. We've got enemies coming into the game, different classes. From Mordoria. From you Mordoria. Got, you gotta be wary <laughs> of that situation for sure. And uh, yeah, I think something like this, you know, it really shows how you got to trust the process. Mm -hmm. You know, it doesn't always start where you want it to be, but if you just keep working at it, you end up where you end up going. So uh, that's what we're hoping for this week, actually. I got my fingers crossed for you okay. guys. That's good. <laughs> yeah, that's good. <laughs> Awesome. Well, you'll be seeing a lot more art from Adam as we get a little further in the week. And so why don't you enjoy some a uh, little bit of highlights from our day. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you live on Twitch and be here back tomorrow for another great devlog. Thanks. Bye-bye. Adam, you absolute monster. We're going to freaking put everything in. Look, I know I'm going to be done in a week. I don't know about these guys. Listening to Bob Ross. Yeah, we just make happy little, uh, happy little accidents here. First of all, get some titanium white on your palette there. And, uh, you know, just enjoy yourself. Some happy little pixels. Let's try and do something, man. This is all very, this is That's a- That's good, it's doing yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. It's get dipping, it's statusing, it's gonna be running. It's, it's exactly what you'd be doing low level, only at a speed that you could never approach. <laughs> I'm just curious, what is it? Low doing? level. Do I go down to the beach after this? No, where is it? What is it? Oh my god. It's one pile. Of is it tattered. applying a patch? Is it applying a patch? I don't know what it's called. Please, 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 Okay, I can't. Cat Tattis. I can, ta I can Tattis. I can Tattis with the best of them. Okay, okay, here we go, Cat. And, 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 it, and it oh, makes okay. you feel better. Okay, look at that, dude. Come on, I'm look at that. locked in over here. <laughs> the conflict wizard could have fixed this. They only trusted him. These are my work in progress character cards. They're looking really They're pretty cool. early. Yeah. I want to, I was saying to chat, I want to find like a style that's like just... Like, this is still a little bit too, like, real. I should have asked for more money. Wrong. Oh, I see what happened. Dude, look at your cell coordinates, you dummy. Look, cell dot two cell coordinates. You went G call G row. Look at, look at. Oh <laughs> my <laughs> God. <laughs> call row. Uh, is that right? Is it, yeah, is it yeah, row yeah. call? It should be plus call? one because. Because, yeah. In, cause look. Dude, what a loser. Look at this guy. This motherfucker's using AI to code. <laughs> Stupid! <laughs> I guess column and rows aren't low level enough for low level. He probably wouldn't have made this mistake in C. I'm a little bit worried to see how he programs assembly. Trigger and assert when I click here. That's wow. sick. <laughs> Which is pretty good. That's courtesy of low level. Hey, hey, can we move at least the line down? The Dude, line? oh my goodness. Prime, Prime is going to do Oh God, Prime, he's doing it. No. <laughs> This is actually an old business school trick I was taught, which is how to assert dominance in the most effective way possible. Okay, they have to react to me and my prowess. I'm not here to make friends, okay? I'm here to build a game, ship a game on time. And if I had to pee on stream, <laughs> I need the TJ to feel it in his ears and I wanted the chat to hear it. But I think it's appropriate. <laughs> now, I have a staff. 
Rare is... It's it's so much harder to with Prime saying things. Uh, what do you mean? <laughs> Dude, <laughs> it's, I, just like, it's starting to giggle. Yeah, it's so, yeah. It's yeah. Dude, look at DJ. I told you. Dude, it was so bad. <laughs> she didn't even use the cheese grater on my feet. I don't know <laughs> she, what's wrong with yours. She knew, she knew you were... The pedicure? Dude, my feet feel amazing after this. I, I mean, I... I mean, honestly, I... I can't blame the guy. <laughs> I mean, I, it, that's a completely reasonable reaction. I was gonna get you to do. I, th I thought a pedicure would be fun. Honestly, I thought I was gonna have a great time. It's <laughs> oh. No one's touching my feet again. It was yeah, more yeah, of that. Yeah, like, yeah, guys, real quick. What? Okay, new mirrors. <laughs> okay, okay, so everyone, let's calm down, let's calm down, let's calm down. The vibes are rapidly dropping. <laughs> okay. We got waves, we got help. We're, we're back. We're... The vibes only drop when everyone starts reading the code. Why are we reading code? That's AI's job. Level, oh, there's leveling? Yeah. Wait, does Mortadoria still work? A <laughs> 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 certain Mordoria. <laughs> Mordoria, 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 Mordoria. No one seems to be calling it Mordoria. They all keep saying Mordoria. It's Mordoria, Mordoria, Mordoria. It's Mordoria, Mordoria. Mordoria! Mordoria! The team? Hey. Hey. How you doing? Ooh. You're holding it down. Wow. Look at this. You seeing this? Devil eggs. Devil eggs, pardon. Can I just Look at that. Oh. It's gourmet. <gasps> I lost an egg. I will eat it. Don't worry. We will not eat it. <laughs> You are being programmed by a future trillionaire. <laughs> Act accordingly. <laughs> I want you. I want you to know you are being programmed by a future trillionaire. <laughs> Act accordingly. Are you maximizing your AI efficiency? Call seven six five barista. Help me become the first AI trillionaire. Hey. Trillionaire is okay, right? I know we kind of hate billionaires right now, but trillionaire, that would be fine. Okay. Okay. <laughs> you know, you just switch. Yeah, right. Look at me. Oh. Yeah. You kind of look like me, actually. Well, yeah, that, and now that's that, kind of crazy. Now that we switched, I'm like, that's a little that's weird. A little like, that's a little uncomfortable. Yeah. I'm also blind as hell. These are very, very <laughs> It's like, you look the same. I can't see anything. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you look just like me when I'm not looking through my glasses. Blurry. <laughs> Blurry. Seven... All 17 pixels of you. <laughs> We're twins. Of course Ed thinks we look the same. He sees the world in 160p without his glasses. Oh, okay, 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 cool, cool. I'm gonna shave my legs this month. <laughs> we can hear you. It's still oh, Matt saying that. Oh, that's great. That's great. so funny. <laughs> Wait, my mic's on. You want to take your mic? <laughs> two mics. <laughs> Two mics? Me too. I should have as well. Skill All right. Shield. It was really nice to see Madison. Uh, the native resolution. Yeah. We don't say, we don't. We don't. Indian resolution? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, let's see. So. Oh, brother, you can't do that. Does my name have to be in the credits on this? Is there any way I can get taken off the credits on this thing? Where are they? Where, what? Are they, is that them? Hey, I think I see them. There they are. Wait, hold, wait, you guys are getting paid to be here? Hold on. How do I? Dang it, it still kept going. <laughs> 
Well, that was confusing well, for everybody. So that, that had the exact opposite effect. I thought it would lock the game up, and instead it just did nothing. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> the programming skills here are undeniable. <laughs> oh, no. All right, okay. I see the game ready. It's ready for pre-order. It is. Two seniors in the room, and we both had no idea what a single line of code would do. It's going very well. Yeah, I'm thinking I won't get to add this to my resume. Uh, from Lex interview? Yeah, it was nice. It was a fun time. Usually, I like my I usually like my interviews to go a little bit longer. Yeah, totally. Like, dude, you have more to say. <laughs> I really love listening to my own voice. I've already <laughs> listened to it on, twice on 2X. <laughs> <laughs> Lex asked me to do an interview, but I told him it'd probably hurt Prime's feelings if mine dropped first. Oh, there's still balloons? Oh, there's still balloons, but only after Prime plays a few rounds and thinks that he's escaped the balloons, but instead I'm still here. I'm living rent freaking free in this loser's brain. He thinks he can get away with talking asleep while I'm out here vibe coding through the night. <laughs> I don't even know where these balloons are coming from. I. I think it's probably a cursor rule at this point that you add balloons if you do any form of prompting. I don't know what's happening here, but I, we we have to get these balloons out of here now. It's not even real tower defenses, okay? It's a fake tower defense. So this is this is my plan number one. Plan number one. I'm gonna go try and go through every single file, and I will na make sure they're all the right names and they're okay. all the right format. They're all exactly the same. And I'll tell Cursor, if you nev if you don't follow this, I will revoke your Chaos membership. Okay, and I'd love, okay, can I put a little, like, refactoring or editorial mode in here? Yeah, I would editor's love if note. I can figure out this whole level manager wave uh, spawner thing. Okay, so you're saying level manager versus wave spawner. Well, you'll notice that, like, level manager is just, like, confusing. You, you saw you saw all those, yeah. like, <clears throat> things that it was saying. Okay. It's just, like, it's super unclear. Can you tell me right now what... What ourselves? <laughs> Do we? I, We're so screwed. <laughs> my, my my serious question is: Are all of the APIs right for like cells versus yeah, like I, positions? I, well, yeah. I, I don't think the towers are that great, but can I just show you something? Yeah. Um, when I was looking at your cells, I caught low levels coding. It just updated. It does this, and it's all like that all <laughs> over the place. And this yeah. just really hurt me because it's at the bottom. Of That's the okay. One. Um, as far as it goes. Uh, we have like a lot, like this right here is actually getting over another fact that if you go in the game and you go to update, uh, you'll notice that we do this like, while we find the update right? I'm gonna get rid of one of these functions to have them be top and bottom. So.